right guys, welcome to Keeping It Simple Crafts. Thank you so much for clicking on my channel. Today we are making this beautiful Christmas swag and most everything is from Dollar Tree. In the description box below, I will add a materials list for you. So give me just a second and we'll get started. You will need two of the miniature Christmas trees from Dollar Tree and I picked up two of the white ones but you can use the green ones if you like. You'll need one tube of the um, Christmas ornaments, the shatterproof ornaments. There's 15 in a tube from Dollar Tree. You will need some 2.5 inch width ribbon with wire. Mine came from Sam's Club but you can get yours at Dollar Tree. You'll need three Christmas floral picks total, two poinsettias and one with some greenery. And you do not need the stands on the Christmas trees. You will also need some zip ties, some floral stem wire, your wire cutters, your scissors, and your hot glue gun and glue sticks. So first you'll want to fluff your branches on your two little trees and you're going to turn them into a little swag. So you're going to have one facing one way and the other facing the opposite way and you're just going to take a zip tie and zip tie the two trees together. Make sure you get your zip tie nice and tight and then you'll cut off the extra part of the zip tie. So now you have your little swag and you're ready to decorate it. Same steps with the two poinsettias. I took a smaller zip tie and zip tied them together. You can use whatever color flowers you want. And you can use more than two bundles of the poinsettias if you like to. I just kept mine simple and just used the two bunches of the poinsettias. And so to attach my poinsettias to the little swag, I just used some floral stem wire. And this is how it looks with the flowers attached. And I just used 20 gauge floral stem wire. Okay guys, and now I am ready to tie a bow. This ribbon is the 2.5 inch width ribbon with wire and it came from Sam's Club. So you're going to take your ribbon and you're going to make a loop and then keep it pinched tightly in your left hand, then make a loop on the opposite side and just go back and forth, back and forth, trying to make your loops the same size on each side. Make sure you let out a tail when you start and let out a tail when you finish. And I usually just cut my ends at a slant and if your ribbon has a design, sometimes you have to twist to keep the design on top. Sorry if you hear something, my little chihuahua is here with me. But just keep the ribbon pinched tightly in your left hand and you're going to take your floral stem wire and wrap it tightly around the center of your bow. Make sure you get the wire wrapped tightly around the center of your bow and leave the wires long. The ribbon from Dollar Tree with wire will work out great too. So just use whatever ribbon you have. Okay, and then make sure you fluff your loops on your bow. And then I'm just taking the wires from the bow and I'm going to wrap them around my swag. And then I'm gonna go to the back and give the wires a few twists. And then you can either cut off your wires or fold them down. But just make sure you get your bow on tight. And this swag is so simple to make, guys. It doesn't take much time at all. So I also wanted to add some Christmas ornaments. So I picked up a tube of the gold shatterproof Christmas ornaments at Dollar Tree. And I am just going to take the little ornaments and I'm just going to carefully hot glue them onto my swag. Now I put one on each side of my bow and then I just did clusters of three. So just be very careful using your hot glue gun. And mine is a low temp hot glue gun that I got at Hobby Lobby and I really like it. So you can glue however many ornaments that you want, whatever colors that you like, but I just went with the gold because my ribbon has the pretty gold glitter on it. So just make sure you let your ornaments dry and always make sure too to lift it up every so often to make sure you're not gluing your swag down. Okay, and to hang the swag, I just took a piece of the floral stem wire and I just wrapped it around 
one side of the little miniature tree and then made an arch and wrapped it on the other side of the miniature tree. And so that's how I made my loop to hang it. And the greenery pick is from Dollar Tree and I just cut pieces off of it and pine cones off of it and just hot glued them on wherever I thought it needed it. So three floral picks total. I will write all this down in the description box for you guys. So thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And thank you so much for watching.